The typical application life cycle is comprised of development, testing, deployment, and upgrades. Let's see how Jelastic simplifies application lifecycle management. We will create four environments, build, test, data, and production. Then we'll deploy our app and upgrade it using Jelastic's tools. Let's get started. First, visit Jelastic.com and sign up or sign in if you already created an account. Next, create a new environment. Choose your application server, set the Cloudlet's limit, and name your environment. Now we can build applications in the Jelastic Cloud. The next step is to create our build environment. Create a new environment in Jelastic, pick Maven as your building tool, set the Cloudlet's limit, and enter your environment name. Great! Now we can easily build our project and deploy it. To do this, we will add our project to Maven. Navigate to the Git tab if you want to use Git, specify your credentials, and click Add. Then, simply build and deploy your project. Let's create one more environment with a database and without a compute node. This will allow us to store all of our application data here. Click on Create Environment and pick the database. For MySQL, when it finishes processing, open the URL in your browser. Create an account and database using the credentials we have just sent you via email. Now, we'll configure the database for our application. Configure the application server of your production environment. In this tab, create the MyDB configuration file and add the necessary configurations. Upload the MySQL connector to GlassFish and restart it. Then, open your app in a web browser. With Jelastic, you have the ability to set your own domain name for your URL. In this case, we recommend that you do so by adding a CNAME record. Go to Settings and find the domain.
Now it's time to create our test environment. To do so, you can easily clone your production environment. Open it in a browser just to ensure that everything is okay. Lastly, we want to upgrade our application. Add the new project to Maven. Then build and deploy it. Go to Settings for your environment and find the domain. Let's open our new application and a web browser to see the changes. With this functionality, users will not experience downtime when you deploy a new application version. Simply stage your new application version in a test environment and swap the URLs with the production environment. Go to Settings and in the Custom Domains section, choose the other environment for swapping. Now, when you visit your production URL, you will see that the application has been updated. As you can see, application lifecycle management becomes so much easier with Jelastic. From everyone here at Jelastic, enjoy!